So hi again, this is Ike Zero YGJ. Today I'm gonna show you the bench, uh, the bench and Mercury paddle by N2DAN. This is a very particular key. It was made for uh, G3JZV, which now I think is G2JL Mort. He lent this me, this key to me, and uh, this has some very particular technical uh, solution. First, it is very, very well built, very heavy, and uh, of course, very beautiful and very nice. And um, this key has only one minor flaw, which is the paddles, palettes. And I asked to Salvatore IK1 OJM to make custom wooden hardwood paddles. These contacts are so near to the, to the arm, so this makes a very long lever ratio. I think it's more than 3 to 1 with this custom pad paddles. This means that let's try in the yambic mode. This key has a very particular mechanical setup. I have found that this key can be used both as a yambic key, like I am doing now. Okay, let's go in slower to show you. Now I am, now I am using yambic mode. I mean that if I push both paddles, this paddle will be making the series of dot dash. Let's hear it. Okay, if I change the distance among the contacts and the lever, this key can be turned into a single lever key. Let's do it together. It is quite easy. You first pull toward until you close both contact and have the yambic series dot dash dot dash. Then you turn slowly both lever and press both lever together. So you press both contacts and turn back a little bit until you hear only dots and only dashes. You see? I'm pulling back, pulling back, pulling back. Here we are. Now, now it is impossible to perform the yambic mode. Try at a faster speed. Faster. So you can use it, use this key as a single lever. Let's go a little bit faster again. This is a very interesting peculiarity because this key is very heavy. And if you have, uh, if you want to go a little bit faster with this kind of mechanical setup, maybe it is better to go not in the yambic mode, because this magnet that tend to push back, that tend to, that tend to call the arm toward them, are, are also provoking some bouncing back. Again, if we slow the speed, and take out the keyer. This means that since we have a very long lever, we can widen more the contacts and use this as a side sweeper. Let's try it. Let's wide, widen the gap. Okay, let's try this. This key is a very particular key. I would not say, I cannot say it is made for QRQ, but it is a very good key up to all speed, up to the edge of 50 WPM. And very important it is to find a, a better made uh, paddles. I asked to Salvatore IK1 OJM to do one set for me made of uh, Bengay hardwood. They are quite easy to use and quite soft. So thank you all very much. This is IK0YGJ. See you the next time. Bye bye.